Hello there. Over the last few nights, Mother Nature has been putting on a pretty impressive display of thunder and lightning. Late in the day on Wednesday, we had a number of storms move across northern England, and that was one of them late in the day in County Durham. I don't know if you've been enjoying the weather this week, but it's been a weatherman's dream. Big billowing clouds, lightning, and also some beautiful rainbows as well. Very good morning to you. It's been a very changeable week, hasn't it? And that continues today with yet more in the way of those uh, massive, dark, looming clouds, never too far away. There will be some sunshine around. One or two of you will stick with that, but the thundery showers will develop more widely once again. <laughs> Nice Good to have you morning. over there. Lovely to be over here. Now, have you noticed it's starting to get a bit dark a little bit earlier? Oh, yes. yes. This job, you cannot help but notice it get, getting darker exactly. in the morning. Exactly. Well, we're at that time of the year, next few weeks, where we lose daylight at its oh, quickest rate. Oh, no. Clocks oh. change. That's soon. cheered you up for Thursday morning, hasn't it? <laughs> okay. So glad you're here. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Still getting the lovely sunrises that we've seen here at uh, Henderwell in North Yorkshire quite recently. Very good morning to you. But just to confirm uh, that uh, the sunset now for most of you is before 8 o'clock. And as I said, uh, we're losing uh, daylight at its quickest rate in Shetland around... Uh, Five minutes, 24, 25 seconds each day, it is getting that bit darker. How's the weather going to be for all those? There are lots of people going back to school today, aren't there? Indeed. Young people going back. And some, of course, the rain just tied in with the uh, school run. It's going to be another day of shower dodging, in fact. In fact, this morning, very good morning to a few uh, big looming clouds already around. This one is actually a cumulonimbus, a thundercloud, captured just a short while ago in uh, Kent. Uh, we've already got some thunderstorms rumbling close to some coasts at the moment. Now, I've really enjoyed all the clouds yes, this morning. it's been and brilliant, all the... isn't it? Now, was it a cumulus congestion at the very start at 6 o'clock? Cumulus we... congestus. Congestus, sorry. Congestus, yep. Very similar to these. These are almost on the way. When you see them, you know those big cauliflower top ones yes. that look like cauliflowers? They're a sure sign that there are big showers coming your way. Oh. And so if you see them or a dark cloud, that's what you have to start to take cover because there's been plenty around today. Very good morning. There's a few already brewing on the south coast at the moment here in uh, Hastings, but there'll be more right across the country today, punctuated by a few uh, rainbows as well because there will be some sunshine too. What's that all misty? What's going a bit on? Misty and foggy this morning for one or two, not for too many at the moment, but this is the scene just a short while ago in Northumberland. Expect more of that this weekend. A bit more of an autumn feel in the mornings, at least. Anyway, very good morning to you. Yes, it may be a bit misty. For one or two at the moment, for, for most, bright enough start. Good morning, Nago. Good morning, all. Did you know uh, this time of year we get to see the after effects of some hurricanes here in the UK? And there's one not a million miles away. It's about a thousand miles away at the moment. This swirl here, Hurricane Danielle, uh, winds around it only around 75 miles an hour. It's a decaying storm and it's only going to slowly move its way eastwards. Could have a little impact on us into next week only in the fact it should throw a bit more rain our way. In fact, the weather we've got at the moment swirling around an air of low pressure to the southwest is probably having a greater impact than that will. And that is because we've got some very heavy thundery rain at the moment sliding up across eastern parts of England, lively showers towards the south and across Wales, and pretty nasty conditions, Fife into central Scotland, some minor flooding from uh, that narrow band of uh, storms, which will only slowly decay through the day. 